utter darkness. Let's see if we can change that. There we go. Whatever, we all would have seen this. Welcome back to Mario Party 2! It's time for more Moron Party. Yes! Yo, indeed, Toad. Yo, indeed. So, where are we going? We've already been to Pirate Land and we've been to Horror Land, so... Where are we headed? That's a good question. I suppose we can go to... Western Land. Space Land. Or Mystery Land. Just waiting for the stream chat to decide, as usual. And as usual, the stream chat does everything it can to split the votes evenly, so that there is no way to decide. Yep, everything has two votes. Great. Great. Right, you know what, let's just go space land for now. Patrol and help keep the galaxy safe. God. Toad with a jetpack. That is the most terrible thing. That can't be allowed. Alright, so who are we bringing this time? Hmm. Wait, Yoshi, what are you doing with your tongue on the selection image? Are you licking the side of your snout? Seriously, we're bringing you just because of that. And why not bring DK? Because DK is great. Always room for a lady, so let's put Peach in there while we're at it. I do like that the moment I make the pick, someone types in the stream chat that that is who they want to see. I must have some sort of precognition ability. Ah yes, Luigi. A man of hidden talents, because no one has ever seen them. And to start off the craziness, we're doing 35 turns! Jeez Louise, hope you're ready for that. But before we actually start the game, let's figure out who we're going to bet on. Ho ho ho! This time, I'm going with Yoshi. I'll say that much. Yoshi seems legit. Now, since I don't have a guest with me today, because no one likes me, <laughs> I'm going to have to ask you people in the stream chat to keep track of your own bets, since we don't have a notary. That means no take back -sies. Play honest, or don't play at all. See that there are quite a few princess bats. Let's see if Peach can perform. So. 
So everyone gets spacesuits except Peach, who just puts on a pair of gloves. Well, okay then. No, oh, no, wait. She gets some sort of strange metal slits on her dress, I guess. No one seems to question that they're on a space station. Black Hole Bowser. Seriously, Bowser, what are you even looking at? You're staring at your own nose for some for some reason. Did, did you just realize that you have a giant snout and you can actually, you know, look down and see nothing but your own nose? What a terrible realization. Brain damage from cryostasis. All right, we'll go with that theory, Lurkopter. Good call. Right, time to decide our turn order. Come on, Yoshi. Yes. Proshi is on the case. Yes, let's get started. Oh, jeez. This does not bode well. Something tells me that the AI will get horrifically lost. do anything else. Let's pause the game! And see if we can't bring in a guest, because someone is actually volunteering at last. And oh, before I forget... I should do that. So that we can actually hear him. If it's there, that is. Uh, well, I don't know. You tell me. Well, I can hear you, at least. I guess that's the important thing, isn't it? So, I don't know, is it... It's, do I still sound all muffled, or is it normal this time? A lot better this time. No, oh, that's good. Right, so the first game of the evening is underway. And Yoshi is also a great start. And Luigi doesn't even get to leave the starting area before he's here. Seems that Team Green is doing its best to lose, as usual. What the hell? Is everyone going to end up at the... Wow! 
That's... Huh. All four characters actually managed to get whomped out of the way. That is... Huh. What are the odds? Oh hey, right, I've completely forgotten to get rid of the minigame explanation. Whoops. Well, we'll pop that into, op pop into the options and do that. As soon as we regain control. I decided not to save those settings from the last time we played. I'm curious. Nice work, Yoshi. Shining, I hope you're still with us and just being quiet as usual, because now I'm getting nervous. Uh, yeah, I'm just being my usual self here. Sorry. <laughs> just wanted to check. So who did you bet on? I didn't see you typing in the stream chat. Uh, I actually didn't. Oh, I see. You're playing it by the rules that if you don't bet, you won't lose. Well, I think it had more to do with the fact that I was basically trying to get your attention that I'd be willing to guess if you were willing to have me, so I didn't actually have the time to bet. Sure, blame it on me. And, yeah. Well done. Yeah, I was actually trying to uh, see if I get the numbers right of of the bits here, and so far I think it was that four people bet on Peach, one for Yoshi, and one for Luigi, I believe. Yeah, no one bet on DK. I suppose that his previous failures have led to some people simply disbelieving in his in his ability. And judging by this minigame, yeah, DK, what are you doing? Finish! How did DK end up in second place there? That, I mean, come on, 70, 73 points for that. I don't know, personally, I thought that Yoshi did the best job there. Yeah. Oh well, can't argue with the machine. Sure we can. Yeah, we can, but it won't help us. She's pulling ahead, uh, even if only by so much. It's time for a first item in the game, and DK is in the need of something because he's down to one coin. Stop! Oh hey! He should be perfect for DK since, you know, he's a gorilla and all. No comment. Stop! Oh hey, Hexus. I love Hexus. 
Really? DK Peach, what are you doing? I gotta say, Luigi had some sick moves there at the end. Took four steps, stood still. In the game of Mario Party, that is probably the closest you get to sick moves, really. Right, let's see if Luigi is stronger than a giant gorilla. He is. So, I guess that Luigi's hidden talent is that he is stronger than a gorilla. Really now? Seems that we got our first star. Time for the minigame that you simply cannot fail unless you're a moron. Nice work, Luigi. And of course, the first thing that he aims for is Donkey Kong. Why is everyone so mean to the big old ape? How do you do that butt spin? Trying to figure out physics behind it, but I'm just, you know, having trouble. And Yoshi opts to ignore the star since he knows that, he, that Peach will reach it before him anyway, and goes for the item minigame. So, does that mean that it's now canon that Yoshi is just about as strong as Donkey Kong? Yep. Well, there we go. Everyone bet on Peach, and now for some reason Peach has to... Oh, hello? Wow, Yoshi. If you were not an AI, I would suspect you were cheating. Perhaps it is all part of his master plan. This really was anyone's minigame, because both the duos are absolutely terrible. On the Yoshi, you roll higher than one and you get the star. Good work.
Yoshi is actually set to get right at that. The question is, will he have enough coins when he gets there? That was the board of the Bowser Cannon, but apparently since he had no targets, we didn't actually get to see it fire. Damn shame. And DK now has zero coins. No money, no love, but hey, at least you got to keep the fish. Yoshi is one coin short. And since he's landed on a bouncer space, he might end up without any coins at all. In which case, getting that start will be awfully difficult. Yep. That's bad news for Yoshi. Ba Bowser just basically bummed him out of a second star. So the question is, who will get there in time and have enough coins to actually buy it? Most likely it will be Luigi. But now Peach is all set up. Seems that it's only one star at this point. Go on, DK, redeem yourself. Pathetic A. If you are this uncoordinated, Using a saw of this size seems a bit dangerous. Yes. And oh hey, the people who already have money got more money. It's just like real life. Seriously, there seems to be a bit of a disparity here.
This time, DK. This time for real, sis. You can do it. And he goes to the Bowser Bomb. Wonderful. When he finally succeeds, it is through failure. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness gracious. This is bad. Wait, why did he... Peach was right there. Come on. He rolled a 29. And rather than hit everyone, which was well within his power, he chose to hit no one. I guess he just really wanted to have a joy ride. I suppose. Finish! Luigi again with his hidden talents. This time he's a master butt stomper. Wait, Luigi, why why are you why are you walking away from the star? Is this some sort of tactic? Well, either that or that butt stomping might have possibly affected his center of gravity. Really? DK is so unlucky that Bowser just goes, you know what, I honestly feel bad for you. Here you go, free money. And now since he has money, he heads right back to the Bowser space to get rid of them. Oh goodness, Bowser Revolution time! Now everyone has 30 coins! DK, I don't know if you're a genius or a moron. Sudden display of competence from DK. I suspect shenanigans. Unsurprisingly, it's early game and Luigi is in last place. There must be a rule of some kind. Mm -hmm. 
the weedy ops to go left, which means that he's pretty much the only sensible person here. Except, of course, he lands on Bowser's face. Luigi, you piece of shit. You were really hoping to, do, to be able to screw someone over, weren't you? Oh hey, it's a DK item in the game. Let's see what item he grabs this time. Well, consistent at least. Yeah, I suppose. All I can hope is that this time Bowser actually opts to, you know, go after the players rather than yet head off in the exact opposite direction for no other reason reason than because. Alright, he rolled a 19, which means that he is well within his power to reach everyone, and he opts to run away from them instead. What? What? <laughs> also, why? I'm really okay. starting to suspect that Lurkopter wasn't too far off with this theory that uh, Bowser has gotten brain damage. What is the point of the entire event if it doesn't actually do anything? And trust Luigi to be excellent at screwing other people over since that's the only thing he does. Everyone gets something. Hey, it looks like it's time to decide who gets the coin star. Oh, it's this this one. I love this one. This one is great. And Peach got destroyed instantly. Yoshi likewise, what the hell? Fifty-fifty, Luigi. So this was DK's plan all along, I guess. Nice work missing that star, by the way, Luigi. Nice work. Fifty coins in the bank. Are you fucking kidding me? Such ill-gotten gains. Wow. Two-thirds of Peach's stars are from hidden blocks. That is not okay. That is so not okay.
I must say I'd really like the idea behind the design right here. We're going to make a flying vehicle. What is the first thing that comes to mind when you think of flight? A fish, of course. Wow. Nice work you're destroying your own lead there, guys. Again? Really? Seriously, no matter who wins this one, neither deserves it. <laughs> and they failed to even set a new record. Oh, goodness gracious. Can you be so terrible? Finish! Caught two steps from the door. I guess Peach is growing complacent since, since she's in a destroyingly dominating first place. Just you wait, Peach. Soon the tides shall turn. Of course, Luigi will probably pull some bullshit. That is as usual. Five coins in the Cooper Bank. Whoever lands on that bank tile will be enjoying quite a bit of an increase in the ranking, I suspect. Well, DK has got crushed to death.
get nothing. You lose. Good day, sir. There we go. Let's see. Is there anyone in the way of the Bowser Cannon? Nope. Peach is racing in them for that star. Wow. Money well spent, Peach. And now you can't even afford to get the star. Oh, no, no, yes, you can. Only just. PK says, screw that star, I'm gonna lose some more money. DK, seriously. DK, they're right there. They are literally running into you. How can you possibly be... So near yet so far. Let's see if you get a get a bouncer bomb now, Yoshi. And go make sure that everyone gets it. Come on. Oh Yoshi. You poor pathetic little dinosaur. have got to be shitting me. Again? Peach now has three hidden block stars. Three. She has more stars from hidden blocks than everyone else has gained total. Just wow. What is most frustrating though is that everyone bet on Peach, which means that a lot of people will come away plus due to this. I guess chance time is our only hope. Come on Yoshi, I know you can catch up. Next star is right down there. So it's a race between Yoshi and Peach who will actually get to it first. Oh. Oh. You could have been vindicated there, Yoshi, but I guess the game is not so kind. Thank you. 
Now, Luigi, you feel what it's like to lose coins. Yeah, I'm not sure if you'd be too keen on the idea, but uh, Tapon actually suggested in the, in the chat that uh, if necessary, you should just set Peach to human and deliberately make her lose. That goes against the spirit of Moron Party, though. The entire point of the game is that no matter how twisted the fate, no matter how infuriating and frustrating the result, it is fair. Well, in this case, it doesn't really strike me as all that fair, since if anything, it looks more like that the game has been rigged by Peach using her, I don't know, Mushroom Kingdom connections or something. Well, just think about it. The, peop the people in charge of the playing board are her subjects. The person that sells you the stars works directly for her in her castle. Yoshi, what are you doing? Well, he's a dinosaur. He has no idea how gravity works. Wow, Yoshi. Stealing from DK, huh? Way to be a dick. Thank you for actually opting for heading towards the store this time, Yoshi. I appreciate it. It gets a bit frustrating every time I see one of you turn away from the store. And you could tell that Peach was probably going for the chance time there. She was hoping to nab someone's stars. I suppose that would have been the optimal development, wouldn't it? Peach landing on a chance time and stealing Yoshi's stars. Putting the standing at 6 of 1, zero, zero. DK, for crying out loud, you're... Yeah! Right, and this even things out a little bit. Well, right up until, you know, Peach stumbles across another hidden block. I suppose. Oh, Yoshi. Now it should be noted that Yoshi has specifically earned all three of his stars by buying them for money he himself earned, while Peach has three stars that she just randomly stumbled over. Five coins in the bank. Who will be the one get out to get it though? That is the question.
Oh, here we go. This one is pretty great. DK narrowly manages to do dodge the money because he has no interest in that stuff. Oh, DK. Not the bees! I like that you can see DK's feet going at it there at the left edge of the screen. I don't think that is supposed to happen. Off screen rendering, I suppose. And there goes Yoshi. Good work, Luigi. You won, unless you act like a moron. But yeah, you narrowly man managed to dodge it this time. Go for the star, Yoshi! Go for the star! What do you need to do, Yoshi? It's land on the bank space. Get all that dosh. And then you go grab the star. And then you use the skeleton key to open the door to the chance time. And then you transfer all the peaches stars to yourself. Then things will be optimal. Still no targets for the bouncer coin beam. Luigi has a bell and the money to use it. Let's see who he decides to screw over. Seventy coins! There are seventy coins in the bank. Time to escape a ghost by riding a skateboard again. Well, I guess we at least kind of got a new skate or die game. Skate to avoid the dead. Too little, too late, DK. Oh! Look at that! Yoshi, all according to plan. Yeah, how does that feel, Peach? Yahoo! 
And suddenly, it's anyone's game again. And Luigi opts to just walk away from the stall because, you know, stars isn't really his style. <sighs> he doesn't want to actually buy stars himself. He only wants to steal them. Doing actual work is simply not acceptable. It's not the stars, it's the thrill of the hunt. Yep. The best thing about Mario Party is not gaining stars, it's taking them from my fellow players. This seems like a pretty sadistic minigame, really. Watch out, Yoshi! Watch out! Grazing hard there. Uh, Lu Luigi, what the hell are you doing? On Yoshi, yes! Grab that star. It's all coming together. Yeah. What? Really? Really, really? Right in front of Peach? That's where you place it? Game, I'm starting to doubt your impartialness. She rolls a ten. Of course. Come on, couldn't they, couldn't they have at least offered that DK? I feel as if he has actually deserved it at this point. DK loses 8 coins in one turn. Alright, let's see how the AI performs in everyone's favorite minigame. Peach, Peach, st st stop it. Stop resisting the money. I like how DK there was actually screwing himself over there. Why are they so desperate to just completely destroy their own chances at all times? I just don't understand. Oh well.
I like that Peach doesn't even have so much hefty hammer as slowly but surely lift it up to support it on her shoulder and then she just drops it. Time for a game of look away. One hundred and sixty coins, not bad, Yoshi. But I bet you can hit two hundred. And Luigi lazy but just goes, you know what, I don't even feel like Getting to the store on my own, I'll just fly over there. Yeah. And the next star is Oh, DK is standing on it. Really? Oh, DK. That is just not fair. The end game is just rubbing it in his face at this point. Pretty much. And he rolls a 1, so he can't even circle around and get it. Oh jeez. Had he rolled five or higher, he could have grabbed it. Yeah, screw you, Luigi. And, uh, oh. Go Peach, I guess. Get out of here, Peach. Get out. And now, come on, DK, you can do it. There we go. And Luigi is back in fourth where he belongs. Yeah. Hello, what's that? A star, you say? Within grabbing range for DK if he gets lucky. That old ape can pull it off. Stop. 
perfectly executed. He was only faking incompetence earlier. If DK manages to pull it off and come from behind and win, that will be great. Because then no one wins. Nice work, Yoshi! Get all that dosh. You need to become one with the dosh, Yoshi. Yoshi's up to 183 coins, well within striking range of the 200 grand limit. I don't think that anyone has had 200 coins this far in the more important rounds we played. And here we go. Yoshi's all set up to land himself on a chance time. Which will be terrifying. Mainly since everyone has a shitload of stars at this point, which means that if chance time rolls around and it gets an all-star change, whoever it ends up on the receiving end will win. Period. We are basically in a position where chance time can change everything, and that is the best position for the game to be in. What a lot, we're off. Indeed. And Luigi's back and forth. Good work, DK. I know what's this? A star on Yoshi's path, you say? Buys another magic lamp. DK, finally. You are showing your true skills. Stop. Team Animal is off to a brilliant start. Why did you allow it to happen? You caused this. Oh, and we're down to the last ten turns. So, step one. Steal a star. From Peach. Kekakudu. Translator's note. Kekaku means plan. But Yoshi, why? He would have reached the star. Why didn't he go for the star? Wow, why is Luigi not going for the star? Well, that I suppose I can understand since you do he doesn't have the money to, but come on. Wait. Luigi. You... Oh, not very clever, are you? Now you're standing in the way of the cannon, you fool!
I'm still unsure why Yoshi decided not to grab that star. I get the feeling that he felt sorry for DK. I suppose. Animal companionship. Just a display of camaraderie, basically. Oh, here we go. Oh, DK, 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 you haven't learned, have you? Oh, a 10,000 coin present! Lucky for you, DK! What an utter waste of time. Wow, they're pumping away fairly well this time. Still anyone's minigame at this point. Finish! But DK Beach pulls it again. That's the second time this uh, team distribution plays this minigame, and the, the same result as last time. Now, Yoshi. Show us your stuff. We finally get to see the Bowser coin beam. Screw Peach! Screw Luigi! Roshi mode engaged. Stop. With this, Yoshi has essentially claimed the coin star. No one has any chance of catching up to him. He also dis deprived two of his opponents of the ability to buy a star, which is always brilliant. So now if Yoshi knows what's good for him, he will naturally check all the item stores to see if he can find any genie lamps, because then he will be pretty much a guaranteed a victory. Now, since it's an easy AI playing, it's probably not going to do that, but... You never know. Oh, not again. Oh, Yoshi. Your happy grin while murdering people. So, no one can actually afford a star at this point, except Yoshi. Huh. Oh goodness. DK!
Oh, DK has ruined everything. Let's see how far Black Hole Bowser can... Well, nine? Really? C can you even reach anyone? Huh. Well done. See ya, I guess. Well, nothing new there. <laughs> Black Hole Bowser, you are the most useless. Seriously. And I love every time this minigame starts and the AI accidentally pushes down instead of up and it just instantly ends. I mean, why is that even a thing? Finish! At least DK, the natural born climber, got to the top this time. Why did Luigi slide out only to slide back in? H his position didn't actually change, though. What the hell? Yeah, looks like this next door belongs to Yoshi. Unless there are some sudden and ridiculous shenanigans. Sorry DK, no star for you. Time. 50 coins? Wow! Imagine if any, everyone had actually had 50 coins. Then that would have mattered. As it is, it doesn't. Yoshi is at least guaranteed a second place now. But he actually comes in first, really? So the character with all the money gets even more money. And he gets the uneven extra coin too, really? More like Doshi, am I right? Stop! Right, everyone, how many boos are there? It's a trick question. Ghosts aren't real. I do like the ridiculous amount of time you get, though. Finish! Come on, Yoshi! A nine! Sweet! This might honestly settle it. Question is, where's the next star? There. 
Well then, clearly someone else is going to reach it before Yoshi does. The question is who? Probably Peach. But does Peach actually have enough money to buy it? Yes, she does. That is a secondary concern. Because Yoshi now has seven stars. A lot of people will be all confused. Why is, it, why is he humming the Duke Nukem theme? It's because it's called Grab Bag, and that is also the name of the minigame. Now we know. Snatch a peach destroys everyone else. Peach is desperately trying for that star, but not really getting there. Another round of archery. Yes, Chief. Occupy Dinosaur Island. Wow, you actually failed at this minigame, Luigi? I mean, had it been against human opponents, I might have been... I might have forgiven you, but come on, this is against easy AIs. Yeah! Right, last five turns. Excellent roll from Yoshida. It's probably not going to help him all that much. Since he can't readily reach the star. So, is anyone in the way of the beam? Nope. I was about to say, that was probably more than two seconds, guys. What the hell? Excellent dueling. I'm not entirely convinced, Mr. Goomba. Peach is closing on the star. Stop! 
Come on, Goofy, just jump already. Lazy Luigi locked out. What are you doing in third place, Luigi? Get out of there. Come on, Luigi, this did not work out well the last time. And you're going to increase the bet this time. What is the point? And Luigi gets wrecked again. Oh, Luigi. Well, I have a good feeling Peach will get that star. Yeah, oh, hello. That star seems to be in a very fortunate position. DK is hoping to do all the money off Yoshi to actually be able to afford the saw that is coming up right ahead. But no such luck. DK is raging hard there, jeez. Calm down, big guy. Stop! Come on, Yoshi, you can get revenge this time. Show that you know how the minigame works. We'll get stuck in the exact same spot again, why not? Really? I like how DK's was in the shape of a question mark, which is kind of how I feel about all this. Uh -huh. Come on, Yoshi. Two? Really? Luigi gets shit for free. More at 11. Now I'm not entirely sure what Peach is up to, but it's clearly no good. Well, that was a complete waste of time. Woo! 
Wow, TK, really? No one is getting to that star, are they? He got the one item that won't help him because he do doesn't actually have the money that he needs to buy a star. So even if he teleports to one, he can't get it. Oh, DK. I really like Yoshi's little dance, though. Send a one's game. Why does she look so surprised that she won? Okay, can you get there in two to wow, clearly you can't. What the hell? Yoshi, why are you desperately trying to dodge the star? I don't understand. Jeez, that boo is teleporting. So does... So due to Yoshi being so horrifically slow, DK now actually has the necessary coins to get the star. The question is, will he be able to roll a high enough number to actually get to it? Could be expected. <laughs> right, DK, can you roll high enough? You can! Nice work! You actually get your fourth star. But the next star is within Yoshi's reach. If he can only roll a 10, that is good. In fact, he only needs to roll a 7. The odds are fairly low, but he can do it. And it will be the last turn, I believe, as well. So the only one who actually has a chance at reaching that star at all is Yoshi. Wow, Yoshi won this one by a landslide. <laughs> I 
but at least everyone got something. And look at that roll. Grab that star, Yoshi. I guess it seems that DK is ending the game with zero coins. Oh, DK. One last fuck you to the gorilla. Yeah. That is just not nice, seriously. And he's standing on the star, DK! Why does the game have to mock him so? That is the second time that happens. Luigi continues to get shit for free because he's Luigi, so yeah. And he doesn't roll high enough to loop around, so he doesn't even get to see the star a second time. And he doesn't even get his item. <laughs> oh, DK. Why is the world so unfair? Alright, go Team Green. Cake it up. Yoshi has just decided that, you know what, screw it. I'm not gonna touch any more strawberries. I'm allergic. It seems that every time Peach and DK are paired up, they win the minigame. Seems to be something going on there. Right. Like those numbers. Wait, how did the coin star go to Luigi? No, wait, okay. they're doing them in a different order. Right. I honestly don't understand why they're even panicking. I'm pretty sure this is a problem that'll resolve itself. Well, he has laces and stuff, you see. Angry Yoshi. Bowser, you're fucking useless. In this particular round, yes. He did not achieve much of anything, actually. <laughs> Yoshi in a well-earned first place. And Peach in second, with three stars gained from hidden blocks. Let's just keep that in mind. Three stars from hidden blocks. That's still more than half of the stars she has. Just putting it out there. 
and a grand total of 23 stars. Not bad. Lurkopter, don't even try to defend Peach. Yeah! Right, that's the end of the first match, but we ha still have two left to go. As usual, there will be a short break while we set up and you basically take a well-needed break, period. So stick around and we will be back in just a bit.